Hello, Zenful Mamas. Hope everybody's having a fabulous day today. So today I wanted to um, share with you a little bit of a breathing exercise that you can even do with your kids. There's so many times that um, we get all worked up and our kids get worked up and it's just one of those things that begins to escalate and we tell our kids to calm down, to listen to us, to stop yelling, uh, to be more supportive. Um, but many times we don't really take the time to teach them how to do these things. And this happens with breathing also when we tell them to calm down, but we're not really giving them strategies or, or teaching them um, specific ways that can help them calm down. And that begins with us, with us as moms to show them how we ourselves can calm down. So I've been in the middle of a, maybe a, a heated moment with my kids and um, my youngest son, uh, when he was, since, since he was around five years old, um, I used to go into his the school and teach them mindfulness. So I did this for about four, four years um, in his class. So he got a lot of those uh, formal teachings, the lessons of what to do. So he calls me out on it a lot. Um, and when I start losing my patience, he's like, mom, breathe. And sometimes I need that reminder, right? Because if I'm in the middle of a difficult situation or of a, of a big feeling that I'm having and I'm having a hard time. Um, and sometimes it's, it's towards him that I might be getting a little bit upset at him, right? And um, he calls me out on it. In the beginning, that would bother me, right? So it was like, who are you to be telling me this in this moment when I'm so upset? But I've learned to appreciate when he calls me out on it because it's a reminder for me to pause and take a few deep breaths in and handle the situation a little bit differently. So we keep each other accountable. So him knowing these things has helped me in the process. So we can share something like this with our kids and we can help each other uh, in the process, hold each other accountable, and they're even more willing to learn if they know that they can call us out on it. So we can make it a little bit fun for them, right? So I have this um, that I bought on Amazon. It's called the Hoberman Sphere, and it makes breathing a lot of fun for kids, especially the younger ones, but even older kids. So what we do is we take a deep breath in when we open the sphere, and then a deep breath out as we close it. It's a cool gadget to make breathing a little bit more fun, but we don't have to have something like that. We can do it ourselves. Um, we can use our hands like if it was a Hoberman sphere, breathing in, breathing out. We can also use um, what some kids call balloon breathing. So they put their hand on their head and they breathe in and breathe out. Okay. So these are like little tips to bring in breathing um, as something, an activity that we can do with our kids. And when we practice the breathing in to calm ourselves down in a fun way, we, even us, but also our kids, can do it um, when we need it the most, okay? So maybe this can help. This is a little bit of a, a breathing tip. Please let us know how it goes, if it helps, if you try it. And, um, and if you like these types of tips, I can bring more of this type of, of videos with tips that you can share with your kids. So happy breathing, Zenful Mamas.